too many restaurants don't have breadsticks, which is bullshit. But they will. <laughs> If it's the law. <laughs> this one isn't that bad, actually. It's way better than strippers becoming police officers or collecting baby teeth. Please leave me alone. I need to poop. Okay, <laughs> let's go. Uh oh. Shouldn't have had those leftovers. Oh, this is really bad. Oh god, I better get to the bathroom. Oh, I hope no one calls with an important assignment in the next five seconds. There are all post-its with remember diarrhea medicine, by the way. <laughs> oh, of course. Hello, are you there? Yep. Yeah, I I'm here. Whoa. What's up? Great. Look, I'm at the end. So I need you to really listen, because I'll be offline for the next six hours, and this must be done by the time I land. It's a new project. Okay, fire away. Continue listening. Uh, Ooh, clench I, strength. Uh, uh, how how far can we go? <laughs> Great. This is that new city project, so there's no room for fuck-ups. Okay. All ears. We're going to deputize strippers as police officers. Right! I'm eager to hear this idea. Continue listening. Uh, yep. mm -hmm. okay. Sorry mate, but I need to hear this. It is essential that we note we won't have to pay them as much because they probably already get healthcare and stuff through their full-time stripping jobs. Makes sense. Okay, yes, thank you. Please continue. It's also critical that we don't forget the program will create more demand for strippers since so many will be out and about policing, therefore creating valuable local jobs. There is some sort of truth to this. <laughs> Interesting. Continue listening. Uh, yep, yep, makes sense. Tell me more, quickly. It would be silly not to flag that most strippers I've met have been, on average, less racist than most police officers I've met, on average. Probably true. Mm. So, uh, sorry, uh, mate. Sure to <laughs> Clench up. That. Uh, what else? Another point that just occurred to me. People generally like strippers. This will help with community building. Yeah, sure, sure. Yeah. Consider including something along the lines of they already have the uniforms. Fair enough. Oh. Ooh, wow, that's I don't know how far we can go, but I'll include it. We, I need to hear this. Every, oh, no. One more point. Of course you do. They probably already have their own guns or other effective offensive weapons. They probably do. Well, that should cover everything. Okay. Fuck this up. I'm trying. Run and stunner. Sprint to the bathroom before you crap your pants. No mercy for anyone in your way. Jump. Punch. Okay. Get out of here! Get the hell out of Ow. This is less responsive than I thought. Ow. Oh no. Oh, that was a close one though. You made it to the bathroom, surely nothing else will stand in your way. We have a clan strength of 5. Stall buster. All the stalls are taken, but it's dead silent. No farts and no plops means they're not even actively shitting. Channel your rage into your fists and strike at the stall door's weak points to liberate your seat. Okay. This looks like a children's game. No! 
Clinch! Uh, oh, uh, oh, okay. Oh, we got our clench back. Oh shit, I did not pay attention. I didn't click there. Of course. <laughs> of course you Kamehameha the door down. Oh, there we go. Bye. The stall is yours. Perf poker. God damn it, you got the bad stall, aka the stall with the abnormally large hinge gap. You can't shit with an audience. At least not for free. So if some curious creep starts peeping, there's only one solution. Poke the shit out of their eyes. Poke. Okay. Oh no! Oh no, clench! No, you don't want. You are already at the toilet. Why do you want to clench? Fuck you! My eye! Oh, sweet relief! We pooped! Wait! What did I have to We pooped! Oh no! Ooh, presentation. You've never felt better in your life. Now all you have to do is remember everything your boss told you over the phone and give a presentation on it. You do remember everything your boss told you, right? Yeah, something about strippers and policing. Guns, uniforms. We'll wing it. Thank you, thank um, you. Hi, uh, welcome to my presentation on... Why strippers would make the perfect police force. Why strippers would make the perfect police force. I'm Yay. releasing excellent management material. Me, I mean, for telling you to say that. Arrogant sure, bastard. why not? This is going okay. So, uh, the first thing I'd like to say is... Oh, oh, uh, uh, uh. Already have police uniforms. Strippers already have police uniforms. <laughs> Splendid. It's going good. They're not going good. Long. All right. Um. Oh yeah. Also. Um... Uh, creating valuable jobs. Yeah. We'll have to hire more strippers if a bunch are out policing, creating valuable jobs in the local economy. Someone just wowed their way off the layoff list. Wait, what's your name again? Wait, layoff list? Hey, maybe you're good at your job after all. Yeah, pooping at work. Furthermore, uh... Strippers will be lost in the community. Yes. Strippers are beloved in the community. Huzzah! Nodding along? Yeah, we're doing good. We're Most doing importantly, good. or um, uh, as importantly, uh, uh. take off your shirt. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice the way to put it. The average stripper has shot fewer unarmed minorities than the average police officer. Genius. Exactly as I dictated. Is this if you know everything, why don't you give the presentation? Why let me do it? Piggybacking off that, uh, you can see. Huh. More? Uh, the benefits. 
I saw something about boners. I don't even know. We already have great benefits and salaries. We won't have to pay them as much. Jolly good show, Jam. Is what I would say if I were British, but my accent is mid-Atlantic. Sure. Bingo, bongo. Bingo, bango, bongo. And so, uh, uh, next slide. There's more. Uh, Strip is already armed and dangerous. Now your mom can become a police officer. <laughs> Strippers are already armed and dangerous. I'm sensing excellent management material. Uh, Me, I mean, sensing an excellent safe. memory. Are you butter? Because you're on a roll. Don't say that. Whatever this job even is. Yes. Whatever this job really is. I don't know. I don't know. Giving such a presentation. I don't know what your job is. Let's do one more. Hello. Are you there? Yeah, yes. uh, I'm here. Well, uh, Still am. What's up? Great. Look, I'm at the end. So I need you to really listen because I'll be offline for the next six hours and this must be done by the time I land. It's a new project. I can't wait to hear it. Uh, I, oh, oh, all ears, boss. Great. This is that new city project. <coughs> so there's no room for fuck ups. We'll try. I'm going to collect all of the baby teeth in the city to give to my cool Uncle Steve. Who needs them for a project? Uh, sorry, what now? Who is your cool Uncle Steve? Okay, continue listening. Yep, mm hmm, mm hmm, okay. Sure, sure, makes sense, yeah. It is essential that we note my cool Uncle Steve used to buy me and my friends cigarettes when we were in high school, so it's only fair we hook him up with baby teeth. Sure, but why? Continue listening. Okay, yes, thank you. Please continue. It would be silly not to flag that. Creating a fleet of baby teeth collectors who create valuable local jobs. But why the baby teeth? <laughs> Come on, man, get to the point. Yep, yep, makes sense, makes sense. We're Tell clenching me. here. <laughs> oh, be sure to jot down this. It's not like anyone doing anything better with baby teeth. They're practically trashed, so let my cool Uncle Steve take a crack at making them useful. You're still not giving me much, man. Uh, Why the baby uh, teeth? Uh, be sure to emphasize that. Uh, what else? And that's every. Oh, no. One more point. Most people like my cool Uncle Steve's projects, so most people will probably like this baby thing, too. Sure, well, sure. That's important, don't fuck this up. Uh, I'll try not to. Oh, the same, the same game. Okay. Let's do better this time. Thank you. Get out of the way! Get the hell out of here! Get out of the way! Get out of the way! Huh? Huh? Get out of the way! Get out of here! Fuck you! Please! Get the hell out of the way! Get the hell out of the way! Oh, we're slowing down. Please! Get out of the way! Fuck you! Get the hell we did a lot better. <laughs> you made it to the bathroom, surely nothing else will stand in your way. Rock, paper, scissors. There's only one open stall and two of them you actively groundhogging. Since resolving this with your fist is probably an HR violation. That we did before? Okay. You have but one option to settle your claim to the throne. R rock, paper, scissors. Of course. Well, well, well. A challenger to the porcelain throne. Rock, paper, scissors. scissors! How dare you attempt to vent your ass before mine! Oh man, no way! Okay, okay, okay. Rock, paper, scissors! scissors. We shall settle this. Man! With a duel! I am Wait, absolute I'm... Dog shit. I'm sensing something. Still take it. The arm of the opponent changes colors. Isn't it the color of the buttons? 
Rock, paper, scissors. Hij gaat voor rood. Ah, oh. Oh no. Zo. Rock, paper, scissors. Oh yeah, I'm the fucking champion. How could this happen? Rock, paper, scissors. Oh no, not a tie. No, no, I, I don't accept this because we're not shitting in the same toilet. Do not think yourself <laughs> my equal. It's tough to watch the color Rock, of the arm and paper, then. Scissors. scissors. There we go. The toilet is mine. No. No. With a clenched strength of 15, the stall is yours. Seat wiper. Well, it looks like you got at least one co-worker who deserves to be put down. Okay, nothing worse than a seat pisser, agree. You obviously can't plop your ass down on this yellow puddle, so start wiping it down. Careful with the paper, if it gets too soggy, you have some strange pee pee on your thingies, and this job's already degrading enough. Oh no, this is the worst! Oh, uh, oh. Oh, oh goodness gracious! Uh, oh god! No! Oh, clench! Clench, 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 clench! Keep it together, man. Oh. There we go. We just need a little, little, insy tiny bit. Merciful Boop. Jesus! Thank you for blessing this sinner's asshole! Oh shit! Oh my presentation! Okay, let's go. Something about baby teeth. Um, hi. Welcome to my presentation on... Uh-huh. Well, it's not my The collection Uncle Steve. of baby teeth as a means of helping out my bosses cool... Oh, my Steve. bosses. Okay. Normally, they also go... Splendid. What? Sorry? I feel like that made sense. Nice. It actually doesn't. But fair so, enough, we'll uh, go along with it. Like to say is, hmm. So we, yeah, of course. Yeah, sure. Um, my boss said his Uncle Steve used to buy him cigarettes in grade school, so we uh should hook him up with teeth. This can't be right. How's that? Of course. <laughs> bingo bango bongo! Bingo bango bongo! Uh, furthermore... Uh... Uh, fleet of tooth collectors. The need to create a fleet of tooth collectors would generate valuable local jobs. Jolly good show, Jam. Is what I would say if I were British. But my accent is mid-Atlantic. Then don't talk in a British Should accent. Not along? <laughs> and so, uh... aliens watch us all have sex. So this is a fact of life. Oh, okay. Um, I think it's this one. I've heard that apparently Uncle Steve is quite the um, artist or craftsman or whatever. So I'm sure he's figured out a good use for all these teeth. Genius. Oh, okay. Exactly as I dictated. Ah. They're nodding along. Oh. If you don't just look right here. Uh. There's more. Dogs can't be trusted with weapons. Pancakes when placed on the head can cure any number of diseases. Sure. Sure. Thousands Never tried of baby it. teeth are wasted every day. Why not let Steve have a crack at him? Someone just wound their way off the layoff Ridiculous. List. What's your name again? Absolutely ridiculous. Sure, why not? This is going okay. Yay! Woo! Okay, we'll do one more because of the crazy ideas that are coming, and I wonder how many different mini games there are. Hello, are you there? Yep. Yeah, yeah, I I'm here. What? Oh, what's up? Great. Look, I'm at the end, so I need you to really listen because I'll be offline for the next six hours and this must be done by the time I land. It's a new project. 
I can't wait to hear your project. Continue oh, listening. Oh, I, oh, oh, all ears, boss. Great. This is that new city project, so there's no room for fuck-ups. We're going to make every lunch an unlimited soup, salad, and breadsticks lunch. Unlimited soup, salad, and breadsticks lunch? This is not a bad idea. Way better than the other two. Oh, yep, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, okay. It is essential that we know too many restaurants don't have breadsticks, which is bullshit. But they will, <laughs> if it's the law. This one isn't that bad, actually. It's way better than the strippers turning into... <laughs> this isn't that bad, actually. It's way better than strippers becoming police officers or collecting baby teeth. This is fine. Continue oh. listening. Okay, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Please continue. It's also pretty cool that we don't forget hungry people are dumber and also oh. slower than people who have consumed a satisfactory amount of soup, salad, and breadsticks. So this policy will boost productivity. Can't argue. Can't argue. Uh... Yep, yep. Makes sense, makes sense. Tell, tell me more, quickly. <laughs> Quick, very quickly. Also, soup, salad, and breadsticks is most of the food groups. Possibly all. Depending on the soup. Yeah. Ooh, I'll um, be sure to emphasize that. Yeah, what else? It would be silly not to flag that. No one can deny that unlimited anything is a great value. And if the city is known for its great values, more people will want to visit. Oh. You have an idea for that as well? <laughs> yeah. The production should be. And that's. Every, oh, no, one, no more. one more point. Yeah, how? Having to cook all that yeah. soup, salad, and breadsticks will create valuable local jobs. Yeah, everybody's at work making soup, salad, and breadsticks and no one to eat it. Well, that should cover it. So, well, we're not going to fuck it up. Ooh, what's this? Hallway pitch party. Your idiot co workers are just mindlessly standing there, blocking the way to the bathroom. Hurl projectiles at their heads to motivate them to move. Okay. No oh, extra power cost us clench strength. Loitering fox. What's your language? Yay! They turn into babies. Rock, uh, rock, paper, scissors again. Okay, but we sort of well, know well, now. Well, a challenger to the porcelain throne. How to? The color of the arm. Rock, paper, scissors. Oh, man, Fuck! Was too late. I, Luckily, I it's a draw. Fit together in the same seat. There's no way we can let this happen. Do not think yourself my equal. Rock, paper, scissors. How could this happen? You like what you just felt? Okay. Rock, paper, scissors. scissors. I'm the only one pooping right now. No. Yep, we are. No. Maybe we should drink less coffee. Oh, uh, until, uh, no, wipe the seat again. not again. Can we do everything? Ooh. There's pee on our fingers. Boop. Oh, sweet relief. Oh, uh, wait. What did I have to present? Oh, no. Okay. What was it again? Um, hi. Welcome to my presentation. Oh, on... yeah. Soup, salad, and breadsticks. Uh... Unlimited soup, unlimited salad, and unlimited breaks for every citizen at lunchtime. Yeah. Unlimited soup, unlimited salad, and unlimited breadsticks for every citizen at lunchtime. 
Ha <laughs> ha, splendid. Hey, maybe you're good at your job after all. So, uh, the first thing I'd like to say is... Uh... Food pyramids. A meal of soup, salad, and breadsticks covers the entire food pyramid. <laughs> I'm sensing excellent management material. Me, I mean, for telling you to say Google. That. There's Google on his laptop. I feel like that made sense. Nice. And so, uh, oh, uh. I think that we was it. I saw something about Italians. That's a place where people can go for a real bargain. Curious what that was. Genius. Exactly as I dictated. Are you butter? Because you're on a roll. Um. Oh, yeah. Also. Um... Get off your phone and read a book for once. Uh, densely brand objects. Valuable jobs. Having to make an infinity amount of soup, salad, and breadsticks will create valuable local jobs. Jolly good show, chap, is what I would say if I were British. But my accent is mid-Atlantic. Is this what respect feels like? Of course, we can't... For uh... Shit. I think it was this one. A workforce running on soup, salad, and breadsticks will be incredibly productive. Might be. Someone just wound their way off the layoff list. Wait, what's your name again? They're actually nodding along? Uh, furthermore... Uh... Last thing. Yeah. Not every restaurant has breadsticks, and I'm sure we can all agree that this is bullshit. Huzzah! To be fair, I don't know any restaurant that has breadsticks. Right. <laughs> Yay! Oh god, this feels fucking great! And we'll end it there. With a nice project about unlimited soup, salads and breadsticks. Please leave me alone, I need to poop. Okay, we'll leave you alone in a minute. This was Please Leave Me Alone, I Need to Poop. <laughs> it's a fun game. There are some weird ideas here. Maybe I'll play this again to see how many of these weird ideas there are. Or projects, as they say. See you next time. Bye-bye.